Hi, I'm Thomas Banks. This Sunday, I'm going to be giving a talk with my friend and uh, fellow writer, Michael Williams, about Evelyn Waugh's Sword of Honor trilogy. And if you don't know the Sword of Honor trilogy, it is a series of war novels that uh, Evelyn Waugh, the English satirist who wrote Bride's Head Revisited, and a number of other books, it's a series of books he wrote about his experiences in World War II, or based on his experiences in World War II, where he served as a soldier in Greece and in uh, the Balkan countries of Southeastern Europe. Uh, Waugh's trilogy is an important one uh, because it shows kind of a different side of World War II than that which we're used to seeing in films and in you know, maybe, maybe some of the you know, history classes that we took in high school. Uh, we tend to think of World War II as maybe the kind of the high example of a righteous war in which the forces of good, of liberty and democracy triumph over the forces of darkness, uh, fascist evil and totalitarianism. And well, yes, I mean, it is a war in which the comparatively good guys won, you could say. There is another and maybe more melancholy side to the war as it was lived by those who saw it, those who fought in it and, uh, and experienced it, which were not, which we don't see as often. And Waugh's war trilogy um, shows that kind of elegiac, um, sometimes kind of pessimistic side of the war. And it's one of the classics of martial fiction. Um, it's, it's a series of books that is not one of his most frequently read, but which I think deserves more readers. And I hope that you'll join us to, uh, to find out more about this this coming Sunday. Thank you very much.